I think the America's Cup has transformed into, if you like, the Formula One on water because both the technology of the way in which the boats almost fly through the water, but also the way in which people can now view this particular competition from the shore side, it has completely changed the way people see the sport and engage in the sport. In the last two America's Cups, we've got hydrofoiling catamarans with wing sails, so now we're absolutely at the leading edge of technology. I think in the context of today, the excitement that we'll see of the race between the Land Rover BAR team, our Swedish friends and others, is replicated in what's happening in business. There's a, a real spirit of competition, but there's also a sense that if you collaborate, if you build genuine partnerships, that actually you can secure a, a lasting prosperity. And I think the most exciting prospect for uh, the way in which British industry is developing is it's keeping itself at the cutting edge of technology. And that way, I think it can be a real winner. There's been many advances in terms of different advanced materials from new metals through to composites, through to new materials like graphene, which you're gonna start seeing now appearing in many new products in the future. The wider commercial uh, application is to think of everything and then stop, because it can go anywhere you want. Advanced materials can go in everyday things, from a bathtub, shower tray, to an aircraft in the sky, anything. When it comes to multifunctional materials and specifically multifunctional new composite materials based on nanomaterials such as carbon nanotubes and graphene. These materials have mechanical, electrical, thermal properties that outperform carbon fibers. I think if you look into the future the world is absolutely open and endless from smart clothing through to even smart skin. Again, an area that graphene research is looking at is new drug delivery mechanisms, new artificial skin. It's a skin, if you like, that you can put that can actually help improve the recovery of a wound or a, or a damaged limb. So again, you're going to start seeing these new materials play a greater role in the future from everything from healthcare through to the everyday world we all live. The UK and Sweden uh, has been very much part of the changes in, in this uh, arena due to collaborative work through bilateral working between industry as well as academia. And I think that's one of the greater things that I've experienced uh, working in this industry, that opportunities and the openness between the different partners here has been very creative and constructive and delivered some great results. When it comes to Sweden and the UK, two very like-minded countries, uh, very similar in their makeup with strong industrial sectors uh, and a strong financial centre. It's an excellent opportunity to work together.